Okay, so today I'm going to do a review on the 2013 Gibson J45. Um, it's a really nice guitar, this one. Got abalone inlay on the headstock, Grover tuners, Rosewood, Rosewood bridge, Rosewood fretboard, solid stick, stick and spruce top, nice sunburst finish. Um, I think we've got tusk saddle, tusk nut, and solid mahogany back and sides. Um, it's really good. I've got this one new, so Gibson are kind enough to give you a spare set of strings, a little pick holder. You get a sticker, which obviously you're not going to stick on the guitar. Um, and there's a little warranty thing. And you also get a really nice <coughs> Gibson plush line case, which is pretty good, it's thrown in with a deal, um, obviously more importantly onto the guitar, um, I'm going to play a few different styles on this so we can see what it sounds like, I've got Martin 11s on it, um, it did come with Gibson 12s but they were a little bit heavy, um, but with the with the elevens you still get the the sort of Gibson grunt as I like to call it. It's like an engine revving up. Right, I'll um, I'll just do a little bit with a plec so you can hear see what it sounds like. crisp sound to it which is really nice um, obviously strumming with uh, your hand as well it's got a really nice tone to it it's a bit softer It still plays well, you know. If you really attack it, um, it it's still still pretty nice sound. Sort of sound, sort of a bluesy sort of riff as well. resonation it's got a nice torch shell pick guard on it which is beveled as well so you don't catch your thumb which I tend to do with a floppy wrist um, 
And it sounds great finger picking as well. Yes, it can sound nice and soft as well. Yeah, so all in all I'm pretty pleased with it. Um, I'll probably do another demo with it plugged in when I uh, sort out my equipment and stuff. But yeah, I've uh, hardly been able to put it down since I got it, which is a good sign. about getting a J45. Um, I love the uh, the bridge as well. Oh, it's slightly inverted. Gibson style, sloped shoulder dread as well, which is really nice. It just adds up to a really cool, nice sounding instrument. Um, I say it's not too high, it's not too deep. So it plays quite nice. Um, I'll just have another little strum on it and uh, let me know what you think. But like I say, if you're thinking of getting one, I've uh, taken the plunge. I'm not disappointed after having a lot of lower end guitars. I've had some lovely Yamahas, um, and they sound great. I've still got a couple of old red labels. Um, and they sound great, but this does have that extra sort of quality. Um, obviously, you know, I wanted to buy a guitar that I'm going to keep. I need a bit of an heirloom guitar as well, so. Yeah, I'm just going to give it another little play. Right, so that's the Gibson J45. Hope that's been helpful. Um, and uh, happy hunting. <laughs>